kids and cadets. Welcome back to Tommy Time. What we have is a 2014 Bolins. It is the uh, five, it looks like 500E engine. I found this on the side of the road. I beat all the scrappers to it. This is what I paid for it. I love that word. So got it last night and uh, just unloaded it out of the CRV. I didn't look at it, so I figured I'd grab you kids and cadets out of bed and we'll look it over. First thing, missing the uh, cover and the air filter, which isn't good. So we have um, a lot of buildup here, a lot of yard waste, double turning it right away. Missing the side chute. Um, units complete. The um, safety brake has good action. So nothing broken there. Kind of peaked on the under, underside. Let's, let's look at that. This is an instance where somebody bought this in 2014 or 2015 and just used the uh, living hell out of it and um, just used it till it, it crapped out basically it's one of those situations so we got an oil leak here i do have some oil seals i hardly come across one that leaks but this one is um leaking excessively stubby mr stubbs here on the blade like I said, they just used it until it crapped out. So we're going to take a fuel sample of this. Oil's really pouring out of it. I kind of looked at the uh, dipstick. It is at the um, right mark. It's at the high mark where it should be. So maybe they kept up on adding it. They knew they were losing oil. So they kept adding it at every, um, every change. Uh, excuse me, every chance that they got when they were mowing, they, they added um, fuel to the crankcase to compensate that leak. So let me um, get my turkey baster here and see what um, the fuel looks like. Either they hit something and we're out of time just by that blade condition or they um, were using regular 10% ethanol. Kind of looking at the tank, I can see a green film here. You can see that. So this thing's been sitting. Got some algae growth here on the tank. So kind of a busy day, sold two mowers and uh, a fat bottom bike. Uh, somebody come out for a bicycle as well. So things are looking good. Yeah, the, you f the fuel is cloudy. I can just, I can just tell just pouring it into the, um, bleach container you can see how cloudy it is and look at all the debris there there is a definite um, separation we got water there at the bottom and fuel at the top so contaminated fuel this will be um, an easy fix new blade oil seal there on the crankshaft uh, tank clean out and uh, carburetor clean so this will be a good one um, I do uh, 130 with this oh UPS is at the door hi no that's too bad I'm gonna go talk to my UPS buddy see what he's got for me I'll be back. 